That just gave me chills. Hello and welcome back to my channel. Cat is going ham on his scratchy thing. Um, today we're checking out some more secret number. A lot of you guys, a lot of you guys have requested this. The Secret Fun Episode 6. I'm pretty sure it is like a, um, just like a little cover of Over the Rainbow between, um, Dita and Denise of Secret Number. Which, Dita being like my original possible self-bias in this group, but over time, I'm coming to think that it is Denise. I just love her personality. Her vocals are insane. One of the best vocalists of, uh, you know, this generation, these, like, new upcoming groups. I guess it's still fourth gen, so maybe not necessarily generation quite yet, but in terms of like a lot of the newer groups that are coming out over the last year or so, uh, she's definitely one of the top. So let's go. Let's hop into this. It's secret number over the rainbow. Secret fun episode six. I haven't seen a lot of like... I haven't seen like a lot of uh, behind the scenes or like variety show type stuff with Secret Number whatsoever outside of like uh, the Eric Nam interview with Denise. 1939. I mean, who hasn't seen Wizard of Oz? We must be over the rainbow. They used to watch us on good old VHS. So You were thinking just the main dancer. You thought you were wrong. I love her lower tone there on the there's remix. Wow, did she sound great. Damn, I remember like in some of, I don't know if it was a cover. I remember it was, it was the, um, it was the, the tangled one. I thought that like the recording sounded odd or they played with their voice a, a bit. It sounded weird to me, but here, here, I think it sounds great. She sounds crisp. She sounds clear. Vocals don't seem, you know, played with. Dita just killing it. I love the way she sounded there. Higher register here. Oh my god, she's so good. Harmonize? Oh my god. Holy shit. That just gave me chills. Damn. Should I take back that? Uh, man, she is really up there. She's really up there. If you want to take all of Gen 4, she's she's got to be like top 5. Holy shit. I'm digging this remix too. We had some electric guitar before. Holy hell, 
well, dude. Vocally, like, in terms of anything that I've ever seen Secret Number do, that was one of the most impressive, impressive things. All, like, the, the vocal cover type stuff, any kind of... Even, I, I, last time I checked out Denise on Mass Singer, sounded amazing. But holy hell here, she just floored me. She sounded so, so good. Um, Denise, did I say Dita just before? Denise is, is who I'm talking about. But Dita as well sounded so, so good for her. You know, she's pegged. She is the, the main dancer of this group. But vocally, she is no slouch whatsoever. And was a really good compliment for Denise's vocals. Uh, Denise feeling a little bit higher up there, um, you know, register-wise in, in her vocals. Uh, Dita hitting some really nice, sultry, little silky low notes there. Um, what a performance. That was so, so awesome. I'm hoping in whatever uh, next comeback that they have, I did really, really enjoy Got That Boom um, quite a bit, but I'm hoping that uh, maybe something more like vocally forward, I would totally be down for that. Or even if you put that on a B-side, um, I'd be totally for it because uh, whereas I always say a lot of main dancers don't get the ability to flex their, um, like how good they are as dancers in in groups and whatnot outside of maybe like their solo work that they may do or you know youtube videos they upload they can never really show their true potential in a lot of groups um, i say that with like sung yun from clc i look at like momo from twice especially lisa from blackpink um whereas here um i would really like something that could show off the vocal talents of this group because uh i don't know if they've really um had songs that are more so I'm, I'm saying totally focus on that something like a, a track like a red velvet would do or a mamamoo that is really vocal forward uh, i'd love to hear something like that because both these girls vocal powerhouses wow um denise is just out of this world out of this world Again, I'd say let me know what you guys thought of it down below, but I know that you guys are also equally as floored and you love this just as much as I did. I thought it was an, uh, an amazing cover. I really like the remix of the song as well. What are your hopes then? If I'm to ask anything, what are your hopes for the next comeback? What do you want it to sound like? Because um, I think that Got That uh, Boom was really, really good. A great um, progression from Hootis. Um over time, you could just really see that they really improved. Even in some of the live stages that I've checked out, you could see there how much they've improved. Yeah, even Ginny sound, uh, sounds amazing, and her rapping and just her stage presence just went through the roof. Um, so they're on that upward trajectory, and they are pretty damn popular. So I, I'd just be interested to know what you guys want in terms of the sound from another comeback from Secret Number. That's all I got to ask. Again, if you're new here, please subscribe. Check out my playlist down below in the description of a lot of secret number reactions. I got to have quite a few by now. Um, damn, future of this group is very bright. Thank you so much for checking out this video with me. I hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you in the next one.